How's it going everybody? DB Sports back with another video today. We're jumping back into my Cyclones play of the week. I know it's been a couple weeks. I've had a couple long weekends dealing with some family stuff out of town. More on that coming later, but uh, we're excited to jump back into this one. I love this play. It's a great play design. It's a great execution uh, done by the Cyclone offense. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. So Iowa State up by three. This is about the five and a half minute mark of the second quarter. Iowa State gets the ball to start the second half. You're looking to double up here, uh, score at the end of the first half, score at the start of the second half. And how does Iowa State approach it? Well, it's first down, so we're going to run the ball, obviously, except we're not. We're going to fake like we're running the ball, but not in the normal RPO sense where normally when Iowa State runs an RPO, they have Jalen Noll on a slant. They have Jaden Higgins on a slant. They try to draw everybody in, hit that backside uh, slant router hit that slant just behind the linebackers and let your let your guys with speed uh, take over and, and burst it upfield no 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 we're not gonna do that what we're gonna do we're gonna bring man in motion here to seal the edge so that's gonna be fine we're gonna bring Tyler Moore the tight end he's basically just gonna run along the line of scrimmage he's not getting the ball he's just checked down if if nothing's there uh, we're gonna have Jalen Knoll run this little post route just a standard post route. And then what I've been begging Iowa State to do, they finally did it. I'll throw the tweet up somewhere. It should be above me here. I've been begging for a double move by somebody, anybody from this offense with the amount of times that we run these RPO slants, with the amount of times that we run these play action slant routes. Eventually, there's going to be a double move, and it's going to be your man at the top of the screen here, Jaden Higgins. He's going to come up to about the 25, 26-yard line. He's just going to nod inside. He's just running a post, a deep slant, whatever you want to call it. I'm not, I'm not really sure that this qualifies as a sluggo route, slant and go route, uh, but we're gonna say it's that just for simplicity's sake. He's gonna slant at the 26 yard line, and then he's just gonna bolt upfield. I mean, he's just nobody's, nobody's catching him. You're just gonna see him nod right here at about the 26 yard line. It's gonna be beautiful. This corner uh, is going to wish that he wasn't on the field, and then Jaden Higgins just a nice end of the play. So let's get it rolling here. You're going to see play fake, and then, oh, that beautiful nod. And then Rocco, Rocco drops it in the bucket. Rocco back in the bucket at the 50-yard line. That's a 30 yards in the air throw right there from Rocco Becht. And then look at this finish of the play from Jaden Higgins. Look at this finish. Look at this finish. He's not, he's not necessarily the fastest guy. Look at it. He just keeps him off. He just, you know, we're very progressive. It's 2023. Two guys holding hands, running down the sideline for another 30 yards. I mean, what a finish to the play from Jaden Higgins. Just a beautiful play from Iowa State. Again, just look at this. Whoo! Oh! Oh! Oh, it's enough to make a grown man cry. Look at this at the top of the screen. I mean, he's just dusted at this point. The, the, the old adage is if he's even, he's leaving. Jaden Higgins is well beyond even at this point. I mean, this is this is just absolute money. And even if this isn't money, you're going to watch Jalen Noel come wide open here on the post. So great play design here from, from Nate Shehouse. Great execution here from Iowa State. But, man, just a money ball here. Here's Jalen Noel sprinting wide open, by the way. And he's not looking at Jalen Noel because he's well, well, you know, he's he's beat. So he's trying to catch up to his man. So you had two guys that are getting big gainers on this one. And Rocco just puts it, drops it in the bucket to Jaden Higgins. Absolutely beautiful route. Beautiful throw. Perfect execution. Like I said, I'd been begging for a double move for so long, and then Iowa State ends up finishing the drive with the Benjamin Bramer touchdown. But that's going to do it for me. Let me know what you thought of the video. I I've been begging for the double move. We finally hit on one. Finally ran one, actually, and hit on one. Uh, it's such a such an awesome thing to see. I love what this Cyclone offense is doing, putting up 30 points on Cincinnati. Uh, defense is still making plays they're still forcing turnovers i love i love where we're at headed to the bye week uh let me know what you guys think down below is iowa state headed to a bowl game they're four and three right now they got to win two more two of their last five let me know what you think headed to uh or headed through the bye week i guess i should say this weekend uh let me know what you guys think iowa state give me your thoughts on the win this past saturday what are you looking forward to next week when iowa state heads to waco uh, if you enjoyed the content drop a like click that subscribe button if you're new and I will see you guys next time. Peace out.